Hi and welcome to White Wolf Yoga and to our flow and let go practice. So like all of our flow classes, I'm going to try and give a little bit less detailed instruction as we work through and that just gives you a little bit more of an opportunity to really focus on the rhythm of your breath and your body. With this class we're going to try and let go of any negativity and just invite more positive vibes into our day. position and we'll come towards the top of our mat with our feet placed hip distance apart. So we're just going to centre here and bring our hands into prayer at the heart centre and close the eyes. And just taking a couple of moments here to really connect. Just to think about what it is that's brought you to your mat today, your, your reason why. And maybe here, just taking this opportunity to set an intention for our class ahead. An intention, just a positive thought, sentence, feeling that we can bring into our heart, bring into our mind, and just really help us to, to find those positive vibes. Just set your intention. Feeling your intention, and we'll start to move. Release the hands from prayer and just let them drop by the side. Keep the eyes closed for now and inhale as we reach, arms up and into the air. Feeling the breath, exhale, take the hands all the way down past the heart. Two more breaths, just like this. Inhale, and exhale, take them down. One more, inhale. And exhale, with this exhale, soften the knees and take yourself all the way into a forward fold. Relax and breathe, soften at the knees. We'll bring those hands onto opposite elbows for ragdoll and just alternate between bending one leg and the other. Release the hands from the elbows, soften both knees, plant the hands down, shoulder width apart. Let's step it back into tabletop. Inhale from tabletop, up and into cow. And exhale, press back and into cat. Relax the head once more on each side. Inhale as we press up, lift and open. Exhale, press back. Inhale in for a neutral spine, tabletop. Exhale, pop the hips back onto the heels, child's pose. Connect to the breath. So in our flow classes, rhythm of the breath and rhythm of the body are key. Let's find our rhythm now. Where you remember, keep that breath flowing in and out through the nose and in and out through the belly. If you need a rest at any point during the class, you know you're always good to drop back down here at any point. Okay, let's start the move again, looking forward. Inhale, takes us up into tabletop. Exhale, tuck the toes, press into down dog and pedal the heels up and down. Walk the dog, how are you feeling in the back of the legs right now? Maybe shake our head from side to side. Okay, let's try this. So we'll soften both the knees. Inhale, come right up onto the tiptoes. Shift the weight forward. And exhale, back into down dog. Inhale, lift right onto the tiptoes. Shift the weight forward. Exhale, back and into down dog. Once more, inhale, roll it forward. Exhale, push the heels back. Lift the hips up nice and high. Hold for three. Breathing slow and deep, you can stay moving around through your down dog if it feels good. Two, and one, soften the knees, look forward, and a big but gentle step into forward fold at the top of the mat, relax and breathe. Feet set, hip distance apart, let's flow into this fold, just a little more for the hamstring. So we'll take the hands on top of the shins, and inhale, lengthen, flat back, and then exhale, drop it down. Two more of these, inhale, flat back, exhale, drop it down, knees can bend if you need, inhale, lengthen, and exhale, fold and hold for three, nice and relax through the upper body, soften the knees as much as you need to, and one, inhale, lift halfway, and then continue the breath as we come the rest of the way, arms up and into the sky, hands into prayer, and exhale down past our hearts, back into mountain. So we're gonna work through some vinyasa, some flows with each round. We're gonna add a little bit more on 
from the top of the mat. Inhale as we reach, arms up. Exhale down, forward fold. Inhale, lift, flat back. Exhale, soften the knees, ground the hands, step, or hop into plank, push the heels back, nice and strong. Take plank down to half, knees to the floor, elbows in, chin and chest to the mat, knees, chest, chin, look forward, inhale, scoop up, baby cobra, hold. No weight in the hands, elbows to the midline, push through the hips and push through the toes. Inhale into tabletop, tuck the toes, exhale back and into down dog, pedal it out. Shake the head, reconnect to that breath. If you feel like you need an extra little breather at any point, you can switch up your down dog for a child's pose. A little bit more relaxing if you ever need it. Okay, bringing it in, soften the knees, look forward, gentle, step back into forward fold, relax. <clears throat> inhale, lift and lengthen, flat back, root down to the soles, arms come up and into the air, lift the heart, and exhale, the hands come down past the heart centre, back and into mountain, inhale, let's go again, exhale, down to forward, fold, inhale, lift and lengthen, flat back, exhale, soften the knees, ground the hands, stepping it back and into plank, again, we'll drop to the knees, half plank, elbows to ribs, chin and chest down, knees, chest, chin, look forward, inhale, up cobra, or if you want to go full up dog, lift the thighs, push through the hands, elbows in towards the ribs. Two, and one, well done, turning on the toes, press them back into down dog. Using our down dog as an opportunity to find the breath, to reconnect, maybe to revisit our intention, our reason why, what's brought us here today. This class is flow and let go. It's all about releasing negativity, releasing anything that we don't want to take with us off the mat and into the rest of our world. We're gonna, we're gonna release it here. And that space that we create, we're gonna invite positivity, light and energy into it. Let's soften the knees, look forward and step back and into forward fold. Inhale, forward, forward fold to flat back, push down through the soles, reach the arms up and into the sky, into prayer and exhale down through and past the heart back to mountain pose. So it's some salutation B variation now for our mountain. Inhale, arms up, biceps by the ears. Exhale, into chair pose. Inhale, exhale, down, fold. Inhale, flat back. Exhale, fold, into plank. Full plank this time if you want, or you can stick with half. Come down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. If you're in full chaturanga, stop the shoulders at elbow height. Turn on the toes, cobra or up dog. Exhale, back and into down dog. Now then, let's inhale, lift the right leg up, three-legged dog, look forward. And exhale, step the right foot inside of the hands, push the left heel back, and inhale the arms all the way up and into the air. Sink into the front knee, but don't let it go beyond the ankle towards the toes. Push the left heel back. If we bring the hands onto the elbows and lift the heart. Keep that breath flowing for three, Keep that strength, two, and one. Inhale, arms up, exhale, hands down, right leg back, plank. Full plank or half, down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. Inhale, cobra or up dog. Exhale, back and into down dog. Left side, inhale, lift the left leg up, look forward. Exhale, step the left foot through and inhale, arms all the way up. Find that strength in the legs, knee stacked over the ankle, left side. Push the right heel back and breathe. Open in two, and one. Inhale, exhale, hands down, left leg back and into plank. Full plank or half, down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. Inhale, cobra or up dog. Exhale, back and into down dog. Catch the breath. Reconnect. Re-energize. Softening the knees, looking forward. I'm going to step it, but if you want to hop it, feel free. Hop back and into forward fold. Relax. Inhale, lift and lengthen, flat back, root down through the soles, inhale, arms up. Exhale, hands come down past the heart center, back and into mountain. Let's go, second round. A little bit more onto this one. Inhale, arms up, exhale, chair. Inhale, exhale, down to fold. Inhale, lift and lengthen, flat back, exhale, ground the hands. Stepping or hopping the feet into plank. Plank full or half down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. Inhale, roll up cobra or up dog. Exhale, press back into down dog. Inhale, right leg lifts, look forward. Exhale, step the right foot through. Inhale, arms up, back onto the elbows. 
Find that stability with the legs. Find your balance, strishy fixed. Here we're gonna inhale, lift. And as we exhale, can we take a side stretch towards the right? Breathe. Two. One, inhale. Exhale to the left. Watch that balance, it's tricky. For three. Keep drawing the arms back. Two. One, inhale, center. Exhale, release, hands down. Right leg back into plank. Full plank or half down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. Inhale, cobra or up dog. Exhale, down dog. Inhale, left leg lifts, look forward. Exhale, step the left foot through. Inhale, find your arms. Hands on elbows. Inhale, exhale, arms to the left. Strong in the front knee, pushing through the back heel. One, inhale to the middle. Exhale to the right. Two. One, inhale, exhale, hands down, left leg back into plank, full or half, down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin, inhale, cobra or up dog, exhale, back and into down dog, hold and breathe, through the nose, through the belly, energy moving into the body with every inhale, tension, tiredness, tightness, leaving the body with every exhale. Bring this forward, soften the knees and step or hop the feet back into forward fold, relax. Inhale from forward fold, lift and lengthen, flat back. Push down through the soles of the feet, inhale the arms up into the air and as we exhale, we'll take the hands all the way down past our hearts, finding mountain pose. Okay, last round. Again, we're adding a little bit more onto this one. Let's move, inhale, arms up, exhale, chair. Inhale, exhale, down to fold. Inhale, lift and lengthen, flat back. Exhale, soften the knees, ground the hands, step or hop it back to plank. Full or half, down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin. Inhale, cobra or up dog. Exhale, down dog, nice rhythm, let's move. Inhale, right leg lifts, look forward. Exhale, step the right foot through. Inhale, arms up, hands on elbows. Inhale, lift, exhale, side stretch. Inhale, center, exhale, other way. Inhale, center. Watch the balance. Exhale, release the hands from the elbows. Take them round behind the back and open the heart as we gaze forward. Hold three. Breathing into the heart, arms draw back, two. Now on one, can we straighten into this right leg and bring the belly and the chest down over the right leg as we draw the arms up towards the sky and then forward towards the ground. Take three, two, on one, release the hands from class, place them either side of the right foot and with a little kick, bring up the left leg, stands and splits. Drop the belly and the chest over that, left si over that right side and maybe if you wanna challenge the balance, take the arms wide. I gaze fixed, hold three, two, and one, hands down, left leg sets back, right leg meets left in plank, full plank or half, down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin, inhale, cobra or up dog, exhale, down dog, inhale, left leg lifts, look forward, exhale, step the left foot through, inhale, arms up, exhale, hands to elbows. Inhale, lift, exhale, side stretch. Inhale, center, exhale, other way. Inhale, center, exhale, release. The hands come round behind the back, clasp them together. Inhale, hold and breathe here, open in the half for three. Stay strong in the front knee, two, and one. Straighten in the left leg, belly and chest come down over that left side. Arms come up and into the air. Again, hold three. I gaze fix for balance, two, and one. Release the hands down, frame the left foot. A little kick up into stand and splits. Relax the belly and chest over that stand and leg. Maybe release the arms if you fancy a little bit more challenge. Breathe, three. Doing really well, two, and one. Hands down, right leg back, left leg meets in plank. Full plank or half, down, chaturanga or knees, chest, chin, inhale, roll up cobra or up dog, and exhale, into down dog, and then breathe, 
slow and deep through the nose and through the belly. Let's have a rest here together. Knees come to the floor, toes flat, hips push onto the heels, child's pose. Strong energize and flow. Let's just enjoy, enjoy the effects of that movement, of that dynamic sequence as we rest and we reconnect to that breath. May it start in the nose of the mouth, which part of the body rises and falls with every inhale and exhale. Connect to how the body feels right now. Where are the thoughts? Where's the mind? Can you bring it back to your intention? Positivity in negativity out. And let's slowly just take ourselves from child's pose all the way back and onto all fours. We'll take a cow and a cat here. Inhale as we press up into cow. And exhale into cat. Drop the head, give it a little shake from side to side. Inhale into neutral spine, lifting up the right leg, tiger. As we exhale, just softly step that right foot through inside of the right hand. The left leg will walk back and away. We want to find that left leg just far enough away from the body so that you feel a nice stretch into the quad and the hip flexor. And we'll bring the left toes flat to the floor. Support with the fingertips as you lift the heart. Keep melting down into those hips. If you're feeling this is enough, hold there. If you can and you want to, take the hands onto the right knee. Maybe even back onto the elbows, up into the sky. So this is a really strong energizing position to help open our hearts and invite more of that positivity into our bodies. Hold on for three. Two, and one, taking the hands down and pushing the right leg into a counter uh, half splits. Just flexing the toes in towards the shin maybe if you want a little bit more. Relax the ankle if you're feeling quite tight here. Let's just see if we can inch the hips back and lead the head forward. Inhale the right knee back in line with the ankle, press through the hands, lift the right leg up and drop it over to that left side. Release the right knee down. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, left foot steps through. Walking the right leg back for crescent. Find that sweet spot where the leg feels in a good position, not too strained, but a good stretch. Toes flat. Maybe hands will stay on the floor. Maybe they can come to the knee. Maybe arms up into the sky. Opening into the heart for three. Two. And one. Release. Hands back down. Lunge splits. And as you float the left leg back. And breathe. Flex the toes if you need. Or if you like. It feels good. Two. One, inhale, knee over ankle, exhale, left leg lifts and take it over to the right. Coming back, hip square, left knee to the floor. Let's tuck our toes under here, push into the hands and lift the hips into the sky for down dog. Walk it out, shake the head and then slowly Pad the feet forward towards the hands all the way into forward fold. Relax and breathe here. Take a moment or two. People coming up halfway, flat back. And then from flat back, we'll root down through the soles. Inhale, arms up. Exhale, hands down. So 
we're just going to finish together with three breaths here so let's set our feet at least hip distance apart keep the knees nice and soft we're going to breathe with these breaths in through the nose and we're going to take a big sigh out of the mouth and that's going to help us just get rid of any remaining negativity that we need to release so we inhale in through the nose arms up exhale big sigh out the mouth <sighs> drop down into hold Okay, let's go two more. Inhale, energy in. Exhale, <sighs> tiredness out. One more. Inhale, positivity in. And exhale, <sighs> negativity away. Last breath, we inhale in. Draw all of that light, energy, positivity into the body and into the hands. And as we exhale, we'll bring the hands all the way to the heart. You're just finishing here, reminding yourself of your intention. And then when you're ready, gently blinking the eyes open. Namaste. So thanks so much for joining me on the mat. I really hope that you enjoyed the class and that it set you up for a beautiful day ahead. If you're enjoying our content so far and would like to stay up to date, please uh, hit the subscribe button below and also share with anyone that you feel may be interested. Your support really, really does help us. Thanks again for watching and see you again soon.